We're standing in front of what used to be the K-1037 facility. UCOR has just completed the deactivation and demolition of this facility. Our work crews have worked for the last couple of years deactivating the building and getting it ready for the point where we could do demolition. There was a lot of controls that had to be put in place in order for us to deal with the classified nature of the operations. There were many, many hazards and challenges that UCOR faced during the D&D of the 1037 facility. Workers were challenged. They had to get on very tall, articulating man lifts in order to remove the asbestos from the roofing material. K-1037 facility was originally constructed in the mid-1940s. It's multiple buildings that were brought together over the years, served as a production facility for barriers in support of the gaseous diffusion process here at ETTP. We believe firmly that safety is number one. All of our work is planned with safety in mind. Everything from developing our work plans to our job hazards analysis to how we're gonna execute the work, the foundation is safety. Great collaborative effort on behalf of our craft, all the multiple disciplines that it took to pull off this job. They get the majority of the credit. They're the ones that are making it happen, but there's also a collaboration that's required from multiple organizations that support the work in the field. As UCOR completes our scope of work in support of Vision 2020, We'll be supporting our customer in turning over the majority of the areas here for reindustrialization and for beneficial reuse and keep the jobs in the area. A great economic benefit to Oak Ridge.